is 8 News Now at 11. The road to the future is a lot clearer as a party celebrates the end of Project Neon. Thanks for joining us here at 11 o'clock. I'm Denise Valdez. And I'm Brian Loftus. Closed lanes, detours, all those traffic headaches that have been challenging us, they're all mostly behind us. 8 News Now reporter Shakela Alvaranga got in on the big party. Joining us now from I-15 and Charleston, where ironically, a little bit of slowdown behind her. <laughs> Shakela. <laughs> I know, right? Well, Ryan and Denise, uh, this billion dollar project, it was done to accommodate the 300,000 cars that travel on this road every single day. After years of construction, Project Neon is complete. One. You could say I-15 is looking its best tonight for its grand finale, 63 miles of fresh new concrete and asphalt. It was just a hassle. It was just in the way. It became a nuisance, in a sense. What is it like now? Oh, great. The traffic moves so much easier. Drone video shows a bird's eye view of the interstate. It's the largest and most expensive public construction project in state history. To see it happen and to see it start serving the community, that's what it's for. It's for you, it's for me, it's for every single one of the members of our community, and that is what makes me most excited. Project Neon widened nearly four miles of I-15 between Sahara and the Spaghetti Bowl. I like it. I like that it's finally, you could see the end. And you can see the improvement and just like from the start to finish now. It's such a big change. There are 29 new bridges, reconstructed ramps, and HOV lanes. Now we might not have to pick a specific time. Might be able to give it a go early in the morning or, you know, late in the afternoon. And after three years, we can finally breathe a sigh of relief. We made it. Uh, back out here live, one of the biggest concerns have been the HOV lanes after officers gave out more than 500 citations last month. NDOT says their hope is that drivers will use the carpool lanes when they can. Reporting live, Shakela Alvarenga, 8 News Now. Back to you.